of opinion. Here, one bag, please. Save your sixpence. All around the cathedral, the saints and apostles look down as she sells her It's nice to see you, Bert. Well, I must say, you do look swell. How does he know you? He can't know you. You've only just arrived. I wasn't born one minute before I walked into your house, Michael Banks. Now come along, I can't stand here all day talking shop. Talking shop? What's a silly expression? What yes. do you buy in a talking shop? Conversations, of course. Well, I've never seen a talking shop. Well, there is only one, and it belongs to Mrs. Corey. Remember, anything can happen if you let it. Well, 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 if it is a Mary Poppins with Jane and Michael Banks. Now, Mary Poppins, what can I do for you? Well, I did want an ounce of conversations. An ounce of conversations, and I'm right out of words, too. You see, I've had a lot of chatterboxes in here today. 
but I do have some letters. And how would you say that would be 50 letters? Go on, take your pick. Jane, you can choose seven. I've got a D, G, R, U, C, L, and I. They're no good. You can't make a conversation out of them. Michael, your turn. Seven more. A, F, S, E, T, O, and P. And I'll choose an X. Now, what words can we make? Well, I see dog and cat. Right off it! That's nine. Love it off us. That's eleven nearly there. Those don't count. You make them up. And where do you think words came from in the first place? Somebody had to make them up. You know, you can always use the same letter more than once. Now, let me see. Super Cali, Fragilistic, Expiali, Docious! Yeah. Of course no, it's a really... word. And unless I'm very much mistaken, I think it's going to prove a rather useful one. When trying to express oneself, it's frankly quite absurd to leaf through lengthy lexicons to find the perfect word. A little spontaneity keeps conversation keen. You need to find a way to say precisely what you mean. Fragilistic, expialidocious Even though the sound of it is something quite atrocious If you say it loud enough, you'll always sound precocious Supercalifragilistic, expialidocious um, But it doesn't mean anything It can mean exactly what you want it to when Stone Age men were chatting, simply grunting words suffice. Though if they heard this word, they might have used it once or twice. I'm sure Egyptian pharaohs would have grasped it in a chip. Then every single pyramid would bear this arrow clip. Oh, but can it fragilistic, expialidocious? Say it and wild animals, that seems so ferocious. And some sort of flourishes it so the druids could have carved it on their mighty monoliths. That's right, the ancient prince and certain would have used it in their myths. I'm sure the Roman Empire only entered the abyss because his Latin scholars never had a word like this. Your breath before you speak in case it's halitosis. You know, you can say it backwards, which is swimming with a lie, sits as a legarf and a creeper. She may be tricky, but she's bloody good. So when the cat has got your tongue, there's no And 16 vowels as well, and put them in an order which is oh, very hard to spell. S S U U P P E E R C A L I F F I G I L L I S T I C E X. 